Hi there, I'm Sean Doman. If you're watching this video, then you're looking at the ScanSnap iX1600 desktop scanner and you're asking yourself questions like, what is this additional plastic piece? What's it for and how can I install it? The answers to these questions are exactly what we're going to look at in this video. Okay, so this additional plastic piece is called the receipt guide. The purpose of the guide is to help you when you're scanning receipts or cards to ensure that you get the best results by feeding the document into the center of the scanner. There are two wheels in the center of the scanner which do the pulling work when it comes to scanning receipts and cards. So by feeding your document into the center of the scanner, your document won't skew and it should go through with the least amount of effort. In fact, if you try to scan a receipt on the left or right hand side of the scanner, you may find that the scanner won't even start the process. So how do we install the receipt guide? Because the receipt guide is made out of a single piece of plastic, you actually need to gently bend it to get it into place. Start by ensuring that you have the right side of the guide facing up. If you look closely, you'll see these four round pads on the guide. Orient these pads so that they're facing towards the top of the scanner. You'll also see this small receipt image with an arrow. Ensure that the arrow is facing down. As for where the guide goes on the scanner, if you look closely at this area, you'll see these two little triangles. These triangles indicate the locations of slots where you can insert these round tabs, which are on the receipt guide, which also have corresponding triangle markers. Choose either the left or the right side of the scanner and install the tabs into the slot. Then on the other side, gently bend the guide so that the tabs fit into the corresponding slots. If you need to try it a few times, don't worry about it. I don't always do it perfectly the first time. Once the guide is in, to ensure that it's installed correctly, make sure that these triangles are lined up. A great thing about the guide is that it's designed to work with the cover closed. So another way to be sure that the guide is installed correctly is to close the cover. If the cover doesn't close properly, you may not have installed the guide correctly. If the cover closes nice and snug, you're all set. Once the guide is installed, it will help you with scanning receipts, cards, and other smaller items by keeping those scan jobs in the middle of the scanner. So with that, there you have it. That's my demonstration of how to install the receipt guide on the ScanSnap iX1600 scanner. If you'd like to download my simple guide about the iX1600, which contains an easy to use feature checklist and answers to frequently asked questions, please visit my website at www.seandelman.com. Thanks again for watching. As always, I'm Sean Delman.